I need seven Vanino blueprints to upgrade it to five stars, and then that will get me an extra five blueprints for the Mazenti. It's all based on what comes out of these packs. Vanino, damn. Vanino. No, it's over. It can't be done with one pack. I get one pack and then I'm one blueprint away. One, I'm one blueprint away. Oh, that's so frustrating. And everyone will just say, oh, we'll buy one of the packs that had the multi-car packs for the Veneno, but I might not get the Veneno and then I'll just keep, I might spend 4,000 tokens before I get a Veneno blueprint. Oh, that's so annoying. <laughs> I've, on the Mazanti special event, it's this stage, this stage 10. Oh, it's only three more. I only get three more blueprints for the Mazanti if I star up my Venino. And I can buy three blueprints at a maximum cost of 900 tokens. So that for the Mazanti, I should spend them directly on the Mazanti rather than the one blueprint for the Venino. Shame though, I got so close. I didn't get a single blueprint in the milestone rewards as I was playing the multiplayer. I got to 30k, didn't get them. I've just found out that I still have a chance to get that one extra Venino blueprint because in the new multiplayer today, season finale, it has Venino blueprints in the rewards again, but the probability is even lower because there's so many more cars in this pack. But I still won't know. Maybe I'll get those extra three. This is a 30,000 point multiplayer as well. And it's using all the cars from the season. But from your garage, they're not regulated. So it's whatever you have them ranked at. I'll be mainly using the Aperta. I'll start soon on this multiplayer. Good luck, guys. I'm madder than you.